Hey everyone, it's Eric here from my 525XL. Today is Friday, September the 30th. I actually missed last week's update. I recorded it, forgot about it, and then when I remembered, I thought, ah, I'll just wait till this Friday. So, just giving you a quick update on the tank. Uh, as you can see, I do have, still have some growth on the sand bed, but I've also got some GHA in the back. So, I measured my phosphates and funny enough they're 0.04 um, so kind of curious as to how everything is still growing <laughs> in terms of algae but uh, anyway I really haven't bounced back from that initial disaster I had well not disaster but uh, bounce in parameters um, everything seems to be okay I mean I think the colors coming back on the corals you can see the pistachio there bird's nest is looking better plates looking better I gotta move it because it's just jammed into everything now um, green slimers got a lot of color got a lot of growth on the creamsicle um, digitata is looking better too a little frag that I broke off here is okay so everything is coming along okay I just I'm still struggling with the parameters uh, I still have not got that stuff under a microscope yet I might try and do that this weekend and see if I can post another quick video um, getting a lot of growth still so even the no namers here and over here behind that the Duncan is growing um, I'm gonna take them down to the LFS and see if I can maybe trade them in for something even this guy here they're just starting to grow like crazy so I've got to got to do something with them uh, over in the uh, other tank where the seahorses are everything is okay here I uh, don't know if you can see No, you won't see them. I don't think You kind of see the legs of the arrow crab in there. It's not gonna focus. So anyway, he's still doing a pretty good job eating up the uh, Bristle worms both the seahorses are still well um, I think the other guys over there you can kind of see him. I need to clean the bottom of this tank a bit uh, He's still I mean he's okay. He's eating and stuff. He's swimming around but not He's just not back to normal. I don't think he's ever fully recovered from the gas bubble disease, so I don't know. I'll keep taking care of uh, him or her, whichever it is. Um, I'm okay with that. <laughs> um, the corals in here, still, still getting some really nice uh, polyp extensions on this one and color. So I don't know what the difference is between the two tanks. Obviously the parameters are going to be different, but I'm wondering if the light that I'm using the, from Red Sea makes a difference. Um, I don't know. Interesting though. Like the growth here on this coral is more thick um, than what I'm getting in the other tank. And it's the same coral. And I can see a lot more polyps on these guys than I do in the other tank. So it's interesting. Uh, always something to compare and, and uh, analyze, I guess. Um, frostbite is in here somewhere. Can't find him right now, but uh, I did feed him earlier this, this morning. So uh, he's doing well too. So, and the arrow crab is. Uh, doing his job so that's great anyway uh, just a quick update today I'm not gonna ramble on um, kind of curious about the algae growth but uh, part of the chorus I'm I guess I'm still trying to balance out all the parameters so um, yeah I'll just keep working at it <laughs> uh, anyway I will uh, cut it off here uh, thank you everyone for subscribing and watching and also for all the comments I really really appreciate you guys um, as I keep mentioning it's always nice to have some input from uh, all over the world really people offering their suggestions and um, really appreciate it so if you guys have questions for me please leave them down below uh, I'll help wherever I can uh, always like to chime in and see how all the other hobbyists are doing Anyway, I will leave it at that. I hope you guys have a fantastic weekend. It's supposed to be gorgeous here in uh, just outside of Toronto, Canada. So I'm going to try and enjoy that weather. Anyway, thanks for watching, subscribing. Questions or comments, leave them down below. And uh, till we chat again, stay safe and happy reefing.